Only few people knew the name Victor Osimen before the FIFA Under-17 World Cup in 2015. But after the competition in Chile, the lanky forward needed little introduction as he scored 10 goals, the highest ever in the history of the competition, to finish as the tournament's top scorer, just as the Golden Higlets conquered the world under the guidance of Emmanuel Amunike. There is no doubt about his quality, there is no doubt about his character, there is no doubt about his desire. But of course, there are other factors you know, that make up the game and uh, that is exactly what we, we try during our time with him, you know, to direct him, to guide him, to see things from different perspectives. And I'm happy you know, for him and I wish him all the best and I hope his moving to Napoli will be a success. Osimhen's clinicality at the 2015 World Cup soon end him a move to Wolfsburg amid interest from top sides in Europe. However, his arrival in Germany was hardly rewarding as he could not find the back of the net in his 12 appearances for the German side. The 1.86-meter tall striker eventually broke the jinx in 2018 when he went on loan to Royal Charleroi in Belgium. The Super Eagle star got 19 goals from 34 appearances at the club. That feat encouraged Charleroi to sign him permanently before doing business with an astute Lille side. The 21-year-old's exploit with Lille in the French league on attracted the interest of Manchester United, Liverpool, Arsenal and Chelsea. Understandably, not many football clubs have the guts to ignore a man with 18 goals in 27 games. In spite of receiving competition from those European big guns, Serie A giant Napoli landed the Super Eagles forward with reports claiming the deal could rise above $96 million when wages and other entitlements are factored in. Clearly, there is no debate about the profitability of the deal, but how safe is Osimhen's latest move to Italy, considering the country's notoriety for racism? Nigerian sports enthusiasts provide answers to the question. Well, um, racism is something which is um, quite huge and can psychologically affect players. But we've seen many players overcome it by doing the job on the field. Talk from um, Romelu Lukaku to Mario Balotelli uh, to Jerome Boateng and the list continues, it's endless. It's um, one ugly side of football. But in addition to that, I remember this is the era of the coronavirus. So we're seeing, we're not really seeing fans in the stadium. I think it's a very good move. All he's trying to do is not about the money. I think he's doing all this because he wants to improve himself. Uh, Zlatan has been one major nomadic um, player that you can talk about. He has moved from almost all, he has tested all the leagues in the world that you know so far. And Zlatan is a very good player. So if Osiman is moving to from Lille to Napoli at this point, I think it's a very good one. We should be uh, more concerned about the boys future. Uh, that's, where I, that's where I look at it. I'm not particularly about the money because people have been celebrating, oh, it's the most expensive uh, Nigerian strikers. I think that's, that shouldn't be uh, the case for now. Let's see how his future will be. Uh, let's see what the future holds for him. Let's see how he's going to transform from this uh, movement to Napoli and become one of the best super ego uh, striker, uh, strikers in Nigeria. There is no striker, there is no striker that can match Osime with his performance last season. I believe that the guy is a very young one. I, I, could, I could remember when he won the Glow Calf, our younger player, I was at the ICC with him. I asked him a question that, okay, where do you want to be? He said he want to register his name, which by the grace of God he has done. As uh, Victor Osimhen uh, takes uh, those uh, giant steps right there at the Stadio San Paolo, the home ground of Napoli, he would be hoping to make a very, very great impact right there in the Italian Serie A. And many Nigerians back home would also be expecting a very, very sumptuous performance from the lanky forward for the Super Eagles of Nigeria from the Moshud Abela National Stadium. Abiodun Mohamed, NCBN Sports.